in India, we have a situation where we are facing a kind of crisis of social capital. As an economist, I study human and social capital, so uh, I'm kind of familiar with the data. Now, the problems exist both at the level of supply of inputs, which is good teachers, good facilities, etc., which commensurately translates into a problem with supply of output. There's not a day that goes by without us knowing or hearing about a survey or a report that says that Indian graduates are not up to the mark, they can't cut the master, etc. Uh, how will AI help you? Can AI help essentially transform what is essentially becoming a worrying fundamental deficit? Okay, so a fundamental deficit of capital, a fundamental deficit of resources. Can AI help leapfrog? There was this myth about how the services would help, the service sector would help India and other developing countries move forward when they have missed the so-called manufacturing revolution, which the Asian tigers took care of. Does AI have some such potential? We are hearing news that uh, AI can. AI has the potential to do that. Every government seems to think so. That it can kind of help leapfrog, help countries leapfrog the deficit. To that extent, I am happy previous panel for having highlighted the importance of the human element of AI. Education is much more than the mere conveying of instructions. And as I was reviewing the literature okay, on what, how AI is transforming education, my questions were about more about whether this so-called transformation is largely related to enhancing efficiency. What happens to issues of equity? Will it actually widen the distribution to those who have access to AI, etc.? To answer these and other questions, we have a very distinguished panel, and we will follow the usual panel discussion format. Uh, I'm requesting, since I didn't get a chance to speak to some of my colleagues in the panel, I'm requesting uh, each of them to restrict their initial comments Six, six or seven minutes. Uh, we will strictly monitor time. Uh, I was hoping earlier that we would have another brief session of three to four minutes where they could respond to each other's kind of comment, and then we throw the, order, the, the floor open to the audience. We look forward to your questions. Please make sure your questions are short because this is a rather time constrained session, and uh, we like to get in as many people as much participation as possible. It may unfortunately not be possible to accommodate all questions, but we can always discuss questions with people who you think are qualified to answer it in the panel.